For the first variation, we're going to be sitting on a bench or a step with a weight plate on our back. We want the extra weight to help us lower our chest towards the bench without compromising the position of the spine, which we want to remain neutral. We're going to anteriorly rotate the pelvis and begin the movement from the hips, keeping a straight back and aiming to get our belly button to touch the bench before the chest. What we want to avoid at all costs is the opposite to happen, touching the bench with our nose only, which means we have lost the neutral shape of the spine. Interrupt the descent as soon as your upper back starts to round. Focus on going not just down, but also forward. Once comfortable on the bench, try sitting in a straddle on a lower surface, like one or more weight plates. Keep your legs straight, your spine neutral, point your toes, and always aim at getting as close to the floor as possible with your lower abs first. If the floor feels like an unreachable surface, you can play trying to reach higher objects like dumbbells or kettlebells. Adding load to the movement is a great way to develop strength in the range of motion so that we improve mobility as well as flexibility.